Yo guys, welcome back to another video on the channel, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to unlock the new Ram 7 in Modern Warfare 3, but quickly before we do get into it, if you are new around it, be sure to subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on. I'm trying to get 25k subs, if you can help with that, that'd be absolutely amazing. If you do enjoy it, smash thumbs up, and let's jump straight into it. Okay guys, so the Ram 7 is going to be available via the Battle Pass, and as you can see, it's this section down here, the A7 one. If you guys have bought the um, Vault Edition, you're going to have 50 skips to available, so you can get to that pretty quickly. You're going to be able to start up here if you want to, and then if you've only got the normal Battle Pass, you're going to have to start from here. Here. So if you're going to start from here, you're going to need 20 tokens to get to the Ram 7. And if you are going to start from up here, you're going to need 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So it depends what order you want to do it in. If the Ram 7 is the one you want, even if you've got the Black Cell, you're better off starting off at A1, doing all 20 to there, and then you will get the Ram 7 unlocked that way. And the best way to get Battle Pass tokens, guys, is playing longer game modes. Play game modes like, uh, if we do come and take a look at the filters, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have a lot of these turn off. You want to have Domination left on and have Hardpoint left on and the reason for this is they are longer game modes the longer game modes are going to give you more match xp which is going to go towards your battle pass token xp and it also gives you the ability to get more kills get more captures on a lot of the objectives as well so you want to make sure you're capturing the hard point you're going to want to make sure you're capturing the flags defending the flags defending the hard point and all sorts of things like that which are going to contribute to your battle pass token xp again if you're playing something like zombies go into the game try and complete a lot of contracts when you're within the game or if you're playing warzone the same thing try and do as well as you can get as many kills as you possibly can stay alive for as long as you can and again complete as many contracts as you can those are the sort of things you want to be doing in these games because they are going to give you a lot of battle pass token xp guys so they're the sorts of things that you do want to be doing hopefully the video has helped you out if it has be sure to smash thumbs up subscribe for not already i'll catch you on the next one in a bit Peace.